If you are looking to improve the way you create WordPress websites by using the GreenShift page builder, then watch this video. In this short video, I explain you how to use the GreenShift reusable template system. Since I realize there are a lot of doubts within my WordPress community, without any further ado, let's begin. To create reusable templates with the GreenShift page builder, you follow these easy steps. You go to Appearance and then Reusable. Templates. You click on the Add New Template. You enter a name for your template, and you get this, this warning stating that the reusable blocks are now synced patterns. A sync pattern will behave in exactly the same way as reusable block. And then you have this choice to make it synced or not. And when it is on, editing the pattern will update it anywhere it is used. So click create, give it a meaningful label, and now we will be using the green shift blocks to design the templates. So I start off by having a container with a height of 600 pixels, your background image. Let's use this image now and animate it heading and the call to action. Once you finish designing your template, you click publish. To use this reusable template, you go to the page or post where you want to use the template. Let's go with posts. Click on the plus, the plus button to add a block. You click on this icon and then select the template. For me, it's this one and click to insert. To overwrite a default template with a reusable template. You come back to reusable templates, click on the edit link for the template you want to use, and then in the template replacement section on your right, you select the template you want to override. You can choose between all items or by using the manual selection or by taxonomy. To reset all customizations done on your Gutenberg website, you would go first to Reusable Templates, Edit. In this example, I'm saving this design as a singular blog post header template. Thus, I selected the singular template and I press the Save Template button so that this change would be applied as a new template. And if for some reason I need to reset the templates, you would go to Reusable Templates or Patterns, or you could enter the editor by going to appearance and then editor then select patterns my patterns and there you have it my beautiful blog post header fully synced correct there you have it now click on these three dots and select delete the delete option to immediately reset to the green shift blog post header and that's it thank you for watching i will catch you in my next one